Okay. Nobody likes to see a player released and St. Pierre went um, last week. Um, how do you feel? What happens in a player's mind when somebody you've shared uh, a dressing room with, even for only nine games, ten games or whatever, um, what's it like knowing that <laughs> it's such a cruel, can be such a cruel world, can it, professional sport? Yeah, it's it's always a shock. No matter what, it's a shock. And, and he's a guy that um, I followed his career all the way through. Uh, he played in the OHL. I watched him when I was young. Uh, he's a really good player, playing the NHL, playing the KHL. So it, it is surprising to see a guy like that go. Um, but I understand it. I understand that this organization needs to win and they'll do whatever it takes to do that. Were you surprised it was him? And do you think it was like a statement as much as anything against him as an individual player? I don't know. I, I wouldn't like to look too far into that either way. Um, maybe it's a statement. Uh, I, think, I think the Steelers have always made it clear and the organization management's made it clear that Mediocracy is not acceptable. We need to be one of the best teams in the league. And so you got to expect that they're going to make changes if we aren't doing that. And Nottingham home and away this coming weekend. Um, you gotta, you've got to beat them, haven't you? You really have because you've lost your last two at home. Yeah, huge games. And that's, that's the beautiful thing uh, about this league is you can't give up too many of the regular season games, especially at home. So we had a couple costly losses and we got to bounce back.